the government trying hard to meet its um, fiscal deficit target of 4.8 percent. Mint has learned that the finance ministry is negotiating with the RBI for an interim payment or transfer of the bank's surplus. Joining us now, Mint's deputy managing editor, Tamal Bandyapadhyay. Tamal, thanks so much for being with us. The Finmint's trying all it can, Tamal, to meet that number. After interim dividends, it's now, uh, uh, you know, knocking at the RBI's door. That seems to be the next course of action. Well, you know, typically what happens is this uh, finance ministry asks the public sector undertakings and the state-run banks where government is the majority owner for interim dividend. Uh, to the extent it can help, uh, uh, you know, government's income to augment and uh, bridge the fiscal deficit. But something which the ministry has done um, in the past week or so, uh, it's it's unique. It has it had never done before. It asked actually the country's central bank to pass on a sort of it's not a dividend. You call it surplus income, which Reserve Bank of India passes on to the uh, government uh, in due course that is after the accounting year of Reserve Bank of India which is July to June and typically in August our Reserve Bank of India board meets and passes on the accounts and after that the money goes, the surplus money goes to uh, the government's coffer uh, which was some 33,000 odd crore uh, last year, year before it was almost half of it 16,000 odd crore. So this year uh, the finance ministry won a part of it um, you know to to pass on to the government earlier uh, earlier than August so that um, the government is able to it, it, it creates a cushion for the government uh, you know it helps government to uh, to to the extent to bring down the fiscal deficit Tamar, right. can the RBI even do this uh, has this ever happened before no, never. This is the Reserve Bank of India Act 1934, so that it passed so many years, it has never happened before. And uh, no, unfortunately, I don't think Reserve Bank of India can oblige the ministry because under the RBI Act, there is no provision where um, the central bank is able to pass on this um, you know, surplus income ahead of the scheduled time uh, or, the, or the interim dividend, whatever you call it. No, I don't think uh, RBI can oblige it. I am I'm, I'm told that Reserve Bank of India has been internal discussing with experts but our, since the RBI Act does not allow uh, I'm afraid uh, RBI will not be able to oblige um, the, the government on this.